Well, um, about two months ago, when Pastor Joseph came back from Africa and he was talking uh, about the love of God and all that, um, and he mentioned something about the spirit husband and the spirit wife. And in my spirit, something jumped. Cause it, so I said, okay, God, what is this? And so um, he said, well, we need to get deeper into this. And I said, okay, well, how do I do that? And so a friend of ours came to our house a week later and brought a book and was called Deliverance from the Spirit Husband, Spirit Wife. I said, okay, God, I think I'm, you're getting my attention. So I started going through it. And um, as I was going through it, I was getting deliverance as I was reading through it. And so the, the Holy Spirit just really laid it on my heart that um, this is not just for me, this is for the whole body. And um, as I started getting more into the, into the Word and into the history of uh, the spirit husband and spirit wife, uh, the Holy Spirit just really showed me how this is a really vile spirit that wants to control everybody. And a lot of times we are not even aware that this spirit is there controlling us. And so... Um, I talked to Pastor Joseph about it, and I said, you know, I, I really think, you know, that we have to t do some deliverance on this uh, and take people through it because there's so many uh, significant factors when I was going through it that the Holy Spirit was showing me that a lot of people are held in bondage by this thing, and that the only way to get out of it is by renouncing a lot of the things, and so. One of the things that, um, that really stood out in the book was that these are vicious sexual spirits and they want to control you. And they come at night time and they come uh, as either a succubus or an incubus. And now an incubus is an evil male spirit that lies upon women in their sleep to have sex with them. And a succubus is an evil female spirit that comes at night to have sexual relationship with men. And these unclean, familiar spirits, they may be acquired through sexual promiscuity. They are prominently connected with witchcraft and spells and love potions and other curses of lust. And they also come through hereditary. hereditary. And, uh, and these are some of the most terrible ones because what happens is they come in right to a little child. And so the little child doesn't even have a chance.